Michelle pissed. Barack Obama caught leaving U.S. after damning video links him to crime. Michelle Obama is reeling after a damning video was just found, and it really bad news for her husband, former President Barack Obama. The former first lady has been alone on the road over the last few months, distancing herself from Barack, and now, we know why. The damning video catches the former president red-handed, linking him to serious crimes, and now, he leaving the United States. You don't want to miss this for months. Patriots have been waiting patiently as President Donald Trump worked behind the scenes, instigating various covert type operations to expose the deep state traitors. The swamp and its deep state rats are far worse than any of us could have ever imagined in our wildest nightmares. It very important to note that Trump role in stopping the deep state had to stay mostly hidden. Why? Well, we are in a communist state and certain protocols and procedures must be followed to ensure we catch the bad guys the right way. So, President Trump reached out to those who he learned he could trust, and one such player was Inspector General Michael Horowitz, whose job is like the Internal Affairs Division in a police department. He secretly investigates the FBI and the DOJ, the nation top lawman. Horowitz hates Barack Obama. He watched as Obama used his minions in the FBI and the DOJ to target Trump, but, like any crime, getting to the big boss is always tricky. Usually, the low-level rats get caught, and the real power players get off scot-free. Well, if you e-read or heard about the contents in what being called the Noons or FISA abuse memo, you have a good idea how former President Barack Obama FBI colluded with Hillary Clinton campaign and their oppo research firm Fusion GPS to produce the fake steel dossier, also known as the Trump-Russia dossier out of whole cloth. We all know now for certain that the fake dossier was not only bought and paid for by the Hillary Clinton camp but also that the FBI was paying one of the authors, former MI6 agent Christopher Steele. The FBI was paying Fusion GPS. It important to also note that the FBI and the DOJ are part of the executive branch, meaning they report directly to the president. Last year, the inspector general launched a secret sting operation into the FBI and the DOJ investigating the Hillary Clinton email scandal and the so-called Russian collusion with the Trump campaign. The Noons or FISA memo is just a tip of the iceberg, representing only a fraction of the crimes committed by former President Obama cabal at the FBI and DOJ. So, there is no longer any question about the FBI and the DOJ committing crimes by falsely obtaining FISA warrants on American citizens based on a pack of lies called the Steele dossier and rep. Steve King just found a damning video from April 2016, where Obama lies his butt off guaranteeing that there is no corruption going on with any investigations in the FBI or DOJ. Think about that statement now, with Hillary getting off scot-free and the spying and interference by Obama FBI, manufacturing a fake Russian scandal and blaming it on Trump, hoping to impeach him. Obama made this statement at exactly the time as those crimes were being committed but, there more. This is driving Obama crazy because it will all end right on his head, make no mistake about that. Michelle knows it too. They have sources in high places, and the Obamas know Barrack will be indicted. In fact, the IG year-long report with indictments is due to come out at the end of March. And guess who is leaving the country in March? Yep, Obama is leaving for New Zealand. That right, former President Obama plans to visit New Zealand in March. According to the New Zealand Herald, the Herald reports that Obama is scheduled to visit the country around March 21st for a yet-to-be-announced reason, possibly to celebrate the opening of Air New Zealand new route to the U.S., likely to Chicago, reports The Hill. It a tiny little blip of news no one is paying attention to, but when you put it together with the fact the IG investigative report is due out at the end of March, it not a shocker to learn Obama headed out of the country for a yet-to-be-announced reason. Celebrating an air route to Chicago? Well, that just DOES and passed the smell test. Watch closely for Barack Obama fingerprints, said Rep. Steve King, according to Breitbart. The Iowa congressman went on to suggest that the recent alleged partisan weaponization of state surveillance powers could be connected to the 44th president. Democrats and their allies will defend Barack Obama at all costs and they all defend Hillary Clinton almost at all costs unless they have to sacrifice her to protect Barack Obama, he added. Fox News reporter Maria Barty Romo agreed, tweeting, S. X senior leaders of the FBI DOJ have been reassigned or fired based on facts that have come out of the work of the Inspector General. Yet, 
House Intel CMTW Chair Devin Nunes is branded a lunatic by the Clinton-Obama Mafia W. New Killers Adam Schiff and Media Incredible. Six senior leaders of the FBI DOJ have been reassigned or fired based on facts that have come out of the work of the Inspector General yet. House Intel CMTW Chair Nunes is branded a lunatic by the Clinton-Obama Mafia W. New Killers Adam Schiff and Media Incredible Barack Obama sees the writing on the wall. He knows what happened to former President Richard Nixon due to Watergate, and that was nothing compared to these heinous crimes committed to interfere with a duly elected President of the United States. Watergate was child play a couple guys in ski masks broke into the DNC headquarters and got caught. It laughable. Yet it was so serious because Nixon knew about it and covered it up. Now, consider a president using the most powerful law enforcement agencies in the world to dupe judges with fake evidence the Steele dossier to obtain warrants to spy on a presidential candidate Donald Trump all to back up their false narrative and swear to the American people that Russia interfered with Trump helped to ensure he won the presidency. Barack Obama better go further than New Zealand. But, I don't think there is any place in the world where he can hide now. What coming is coming, and this is so horrendous that there is nothing in America history to compare it to not Richard Nixon, not even Benedict Arnold. Barack Obama has outdone every traitor to America in history, and that is how he will be remembered, that the sick legacy he earned.